Hello, I'm Dr. Neil Noto Roberto, uh, an ophthalmologist with Eye Care 2020, and I'm here today to talk about frequently asked questions of what to expect after cataract surgery. Uh, cataract surgery is an outpatient procedure, uh, which means that if you're operated in the morning, uh, you'll usually come home relatively, you know, within a few hours uh, after surgery that same day, same morning. If your surgery is in the afternoon, obviously, you'll go home that same afternoon. Uh, after you're finished with surgery in the operating room, you will be rolled to recovery. Uh, in the recovery room, uh, you'll notice that there'll be a plastic shield over your eye. The purpose of the shield is so you don't rub the eye inadvertently. Uh, we use a self-sealing incision during surgery, so we don't typically use any sutures. Uh, and the self-sealing incision is strong enough to keep the globe or the eye maintained. Uh, without any extenuous uh, pressure uh, that may be greater uh, than the pressure that's inside the eye. So for example, rubbing the eye really hard or pressing on it would actually make the, the, uh, the incision leak. Um, and that's something that we wouldn't want to happen. So the shield again is for your own protection. You're definitely gonna be wearing that shield for the first seven nights. And then after seven nights, uh, the wound will be strong enough to withstand uh, some uh, normal uh, types of um, pressure. So there are some restrictions uh, after surgery that we uh, delineate to our patients. Uh, specifically, uh, we ask them not to lift anything heavier than five pounds. We really don't want them to increase their intrathoracic pressure for seven days. That pressure can sometimes cause an increase in pressure uh, that will be transmitted to the eye and open the wound up. Um, another restriction is uh, not to bend over past the heart level. Uh, we do not want gravity to work against us. We don't, again, we don't want undue pressure to open up that wound um, as well. We urge you also after surgery not to get any water in the, into the eye. So if you take a shower, you know, from the chin down or the back is fine, but obviously you don't want to put water on your face and get any water from a shower head or even a faucet into the eye in the off chance that there may be bacteria or some other organism in the water. Lastly, we asked people not to rub the eye or put pressure on the eye as well. We don't want to open or have the wound leak, allowing bacteria to get into the eye during that critical seven day healing process. Um, the drops uh, will be restarted that you had started taking before surgery. Um, you will restart them after you get home. Uh, you'll be given a sheet uh, before surgery, uh, preoperatively, with a pictures, uh, with instructions and photographs of what the bottles look like and the names of the medications. Uh, there'll be nice little circles or bubbles where you can fill them in as you take the medicine and keep track of them. Uh, so you know where you are at different phases during the day. The drops are tapered, meaning reduced over time, over a period of four weeks until they stop. You will have some vision after surgery. Uh, the vision will be fairly good, um, but uh, not perfect uh, because you'll have some swelling from surgery. The pupil will be dilated. Now, having said that, the vision comes back fairly rapidly. I usually tell most patients that 50% of the vision will return the next day enough to start driving, and 10% more or so every day after that. So it'll be a beautiful linear rise with the vision improving um, uh, steadily uh, on a daily basis. Uh, for some people, it's almost uh, within a day they're seeing perfectly, and for some people, it could be a week or two. It depends upon the healing process and other comorbidities or issues that the patient may have, uh, either with the eye itself or even with their body, You know, whether you have diabetes or some other type of systemic, that means bodily inflammatory disease that can have an impact on the way you heal. And so we take that into account. And sometimes we uh, involve that patient in some extra post-operative visits or some extra post-operative care if necessary. Uh, you will be seen either that day or the next day after surgery in the office, and then typically about a week later, and then at day 30, about a month after surgery. At that last visit, you will be prescribed glasses if they're necessary. Uh, to help you read, let's say, if you did not get a multifocal implant, or to help you see distance if you did not opt to have astigmatism removed. That should, again, uh, be done at the last visit as long as the healing process goes according to schedule.
We ask the patients that if they have any problems during the postoperative period, and I remind you every day should be a better day, but if you're having any pain, vision loss, flashes of light, new floaters, increased eye redness, obviously call our office immediately. During the day, you'll reach our staff and we'll get you in immediately. If it's at night, weekends, or a holiday, our emergency number will give you any of our doctors on call 24 seven. So we urge you to keep that communication open. And even if you have questions or concerns, you know, call us. We'd rather hear from you than not hear from you because you and, and us, all of us have invested a lot of time into your success and we want everything to be the best it can for you. Uh, many patients have a second cataract that need to be done afterwards. And if that's the case, that'll be done within two to four weeks uh, after the first uh, surgery. And that really depends upon their insurance and, and their health status, and as well as their, their own schedule and how they want to um, uh, manipulate that afterwards. I hope this helped a lot. If you have any further questions, feel free to reach out to us on our website. Uh, there's a link for a contact us and those questions are usually answered within 24 to 48 hours. Um, once again, thank you. I'm Dr. Neil Noto Roberto, I Care 2020. Have a great day.